Hi! Hello! Violet here. Welcome back to my channel. And if this is your first time here, nice to meet you. This is part two of my Xenoblade Chronicles 3 video project. If you would like to watch part one, which coincidentally is chapter one, I will put that link in the description below. And I forgot to mention this in the intro for part one, chapter one, but there will be one part for each chapter of the game and then a separate video for Future Redeemed. So that's eight videos in total for the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 video series. And this is part two, chapter two. I really feel like that's pretty self-explanatory. So let's just go. Thanks for being here and thanks for watching. Okay. Agnes and Kevis working together as a team. Her diary. Tyon seems a little dissatisfied. But at the time, his thinking was quite aligned with mine. Finding a path that lets us all live. I will make that my mission. Flashback. Now just run. <laughs> oh, is this when they Why see their friend die? <laughs> no, over here. It's okay to cry, we Lance. Can go through here, and then we're out. All right. Oh no! Sparks. We almost made it. No. <laughs> I'm sorry. Huh? If I'd been just a bit faster, I could have saved many more lives. Uh, who are? I'm Ethel, from Colony 4. Silvercoat Ethel! She pushed her colony all the way to rank silver, and in her third term at that. Some do call me that. However, a person's worth isn't in their color. It's here. Nice blade you've got. It's a wild ride, this passage of fate. We got ourselves a nice little awakening. You were all talk when you left here, but you've nothing to show for it, D. Oh, spare me, P. After all, I did precisely what I was meant to do. So, about that huge bet of yours? Pray tell us who won. Ah, a draw, I think. 
And with two whole colonies on the field. We should have sallied forth in the first place. The whole thing would have been done by tea time. Duh. It was Jay who insisted on it. I thought that that had already been communicated. In that case, I believe it's my turn next. H, I'm pretty sure you already had your kicks the other day when you wiped out Colony 8, no? Surely the turn is mine. Honestly, you make more noise than the rabble at a feast. That. Even if you did stop its raging flow, it will soon burst through. All it takes is the slightest fissure. And that is fate. I've told you before, haven't I? D. Ah, the gang's all here again. Okay. Will you go? It's the whole fucking alphabet! If you say I go, I go. Well then, let us see how far the flow brings them this time. The flow, the passage of fate. The passage of fate! The passage of fate! D, J, K, H. There were more. There were at least... No! Yeah! <laughs> Guys, what do you think you're doing? Oh, we are gaming! Oh, Look at this fashion! Hey, morning! Hey! Oh, it's an Did orange wait, scarf. Kid? Honestly, I'm surprised you haven't gone and woken up the whole Forsaken Continent. <laughs> so? Oh, this. We reckon we might be able to do the same as what Noah and Mio did. Yeah, let's you go! Reckoned? You mean that Ouroboros thing? Yeah. How badass was that? We thought if we pulled it off, it'd raise our chances of survival a whole bunch. And you think it's that easy? Huh? I mean... I don't mean to burst your bubble here, but don't you think maybe that power's meant only for them? Yeah, but that Mobius guy, he did refer to us. I just thought... You thought maybe you could transform as well? What makes you think it would be you two anyway? Say it is possible. It could be me and Lance. It's just... Kind of a feeling. Yeah, just a hunch. Go right? off that hunch. Go off Something that feeling. Wrong. Not at all. Then uh, I guess that leaves me with her. She's cool. Look at that outfit. Was Riku <sighs> hitting the other really Nopon to win? Oh, what are you moaning about now? Let's drop it. I don't want us bickering this early. Especially not now we seem to be sharing a common destiny, we happy few. If I didn't know better, I'd say you're trying to get us all worked up. Think whatever you want. I think you might be on the mark, though. Oh? We were all there, every one of us, in the same situation. Now, hold on. The only difference was, I was set on protecting Mio, protecting all of you guys. And then I suddenly transformed. That's it? That's all it took? Yeah. So you can take that form via a strong desire or emotion? Possibly. Probably too much to ask a Professor Grump here. What, me? Well, who do you think? And you're any different? What, me? <laughs> As if I'm gonna join with you. Uni. Come on, though. You're not going to manage this overnight. Not the way you all are right now. Even so, it can't hurt to have a little hope, can it? Hmm. I suppose there's logic in that. Yeah, it's gonna take the whole game. We have to build up our affinity. Come on, it's Xenoblade. They don't know that, though. So hang on, there was... Oh, and there was P. There was P, D, 
J K H. I think there were at least seven of them. One, two, three, four, five. And then there was the purple. You know who used to talk an awful lot about the passage of fate? My old friend. The passage of fate. The passage of fate. My God, the passage of fate. Okay, so that we're back to our old friend Albus and Klaus. Oh, and um, Galena. J. D H. Fuck, that cutscene was wild. <gasps> we have Dennis Hopper. Oh my God, D is Dennis Hopper. K. Uh, J is Juju. K is Klaus. I mean, come on. And then P is Pete. Uh, also known as Lion Pete. Oh, was L one of them? Was L one of them? Was L one? E is Easy Rider. B for bisexual. H is for homie handies. Oh yeah, L is for lesbians. How could I forget that? Thank you, I'm so sorry. There's a whole alphabet of unknown masked armored figures. It's a whole ass alphabet. There's probably 26 of them. They're doing the whole god thing where they're like, oh, we're gods and we're bored. So we're gonna bet, we're gonna place bets and kill everyone for our our entertainment. This fashion is so cute. I love the red. That's very, uh, the future connected. I like that there's a lot of turtlenecks. Everyone looks cute. I'm sorry, I thought that was a red scarf. It's orange. Character design's awesome. Won't they be able to find us through our irises? I feel like this is kind of a, an oversight. Maybe this is why we have to remove them because they're gonna find us. They'll track us through our irises. What if they were like, you've got some mail. <laughs> and then Consul was like, by the way, I saw Loveless for the 69th time. I'm so excited for this adventure. This is, look at the, it's just the colors. Everything is beautiful. Yes! <gasps> this can be done while exploring the world or while in battle. While in battle! Oh, that's new. Leave it to me. Yes, he is <gasps> the boss. <laughs> I'll handle this. Might as well, yeah? Big responsibility. Oh my god! This is gonna be so fun! I'm gonna play this game forever. Fix this. Oh, Lance, did you just fix your hair? I mean, not Lance. Squats! You do squats! <laughs> oh, there's different backgrounds. Oh my god. First impressions of this video game, I fucking love it. I'm, <laughs> I cannot wait. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. That was only the first chapter. That was only the first chapter and I feel so invested. One thing I really enjoyed about Xenoblade 1 was the title song uh, is incredibly beautiful. And um, as the game progressed, I felt like the title song came to mean more and more. And I have a feeling it will be similar to that in this game as well. Oh my God, loading screen tips. Is that new? That seems new. So I wrote down some notes. I also didn't really sleep because I was thinking about this video game. There's a lot to take in. Obviously everything means something. Every day's a training day. Every day's a training day. <laughs> I was like briefly talking about Noah, like the name Noah being important because Noah in uh Noah being a figure uh, who um, like, helps people and also um, took took people to like a new land, a new world, okay? So I'm thinking about Noah in the context of Xenoblade 3. And I was also thinking about Van Damme. There might be some sort of world travel, like Noah and, Pe and friends might be like escaping in order to try to survive or these other hooded, um, creatures, figures who are placing bets, you know, on the colonies, they might end up here. So there's definitely some, there, there is world travel. There will be world travel, but I, I'm thinking about that specifically in the context of like 
Noah and that name being very important. Right now I'm latching on to the name Noah being important and the symbolism behind the name. Um, but don't worry, I'll latch on to other things later. I'm really fixated on world travel. In previous Xenoblade games, we, by the end of the game, you come to learn that, you know, you've been, they've been watching you the whole time or keeping tabs on you the whole time. So obviously that's the case again. So I have to keep that in mind. This is all exciting to me. Anytime I hear a character say the passage of fate, I lose my mind. So wait, so first of all, let's talk about this. Okay, we have, we right off the bat, I'm at the very beginning of chapter two. And I have six characters. Every day's a training day. Every, and Lance is doing squats, which is very important. But this is a lot of characters to have right away. I kind of feel like, I mean, I'm excited, but I kind of feel like I, they're going to be taken away from me. Six, six right at the very beginning? Something's going to happen. What if one of them betrays me? Oh my God. None of you better betray me. I like all of you. I love all of you. I would die for all of you. No one betray me. Do you hear me? Are you listening? I was starting to like theorize about like color theory and contrast. Last night when I was not sleeping and when I was thinking about Xenoblades. So anyway, I'm fine. Everything's fine. I'm with you. These two. One hand. Senna. Easy. Incredible. Cool. I love when they show off their landscapes. Hey guys, could I have a moment? Meh? Hmm? Meh? Yeah? What's up? There's something that I forgot to tell you. It's about who in charge of Dindin duties? No. From now on, Din -din. I want us to avoid combat as much as possible. Oh. Not saying I'm against the idea, but why? Guess it'd suck having to draw on our allies. Do we just knock them out cold or something? Or get them to surrender? How kind of you. Huh? I'm sure our past victims will appreciate that. You little... We don't need to take any more lives. There's no point. <sighs> There's a reason we met. There has to be. Huh? You think? Back then, if we hadn't met each other, we wouldn't be here like this now. Even though we're being chased by both nations at once. We get chased, we run. Easy. A smart new decision. We'll keep on running to that sword. Oh my God. Uh, uh, talk about bad blood. Just give it time. It's early days. Maybe so. Funny pattern you got there. You can talk. You've got those shiny chest doodads. We've always had these. You know, I've never even thought of myself as strange before. So many things. Taken for granted. We're pretty different, huh? Worlds apart. No one's worlds apart. If anything, we should be questioning all that we've thought to be true. Differences are all a matter of perspective. <laughs> Our skeptic. Hey, are you always like this? Of course. It's my nature. Hmm. Personally, I think it's easier to take things at face value, you know? Now, wouldn't that be nice? Huh? You making fun of me? All I said was, it would be nice. Oh, no, you don't. You just call me an airhead, you jerk. This is just... How long are you going to drag this out? For as long as I spark in need to. Until you come clean, four eyes. Don't say four eyes, that's not nice. This. I think they should stop using their irises. I feel like that's a 
weak spot. I should have toppled it first, but we're just gonna use. Whoa! What was that? Her thing turns into a. I love that. <laughs> Senna and Lance, it's cardio days for them, so they are thriving right now. I what? You could really use a shower? Could you kill for a shower, though? Could you kill for a shower? Never give up on your dreams, Senna. Yeah, kids, play this game that's about um, questioning questioning uh, your, the, your mortality and the meaning of life and your existence and choosing your own path which in the case of Xenoblade 3 so far is the path to living. Noah was like, don't kill anything. And then I immediately murder all the animals in this entire valley. Oh, really? Shil Shil is not Nopon of dubious origin. Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, I totally believe you. This little Nopon back here is not wearing any clothes. Honestly, live your life, Nopon. Don't be bound by society's expectations to wear clothes. Live your life, be free. Dealing with independent Nopon has the benefit of being untraceable by our former colonies. What about your iris? I feel like they can easily trace you. I mean, if they can film us for their secret society of mysteriously armored figures n named f A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, you know, who gives a fuck. If they can film us, the irises are definitely tracking us. Can we maybe train? I love all these scenes. I miss the good old silver days. Didn't have to rely on rations back then. We had cooks come and serve us right on the front line. Used to get Armu sirloin, we did. Seriously? Oh, hey, what now? <gasps> My own indiscretion has caused you difficulties. I'm sorry. No, uh, we would never. Yeah. Our apologies, <clears throat> Commander <throat> Ethel. That was all uh, just banter. Believe me, we had no intention of. You enjoyed eating our mistake, did you? Uh, yes, I did. Tastiest food I ever ate. I liked it as well, and I hope we will have it again. So lend me your strength. Mom. Yes, Mom. I don't see what's wrong with Wolf, personally. <laughs> That's because you have poor taste. I'm jealous. Oh, well. Trade you my taste buds? No, thank you. My mouth had turned as foul as yours. <laughs> True that. They cleared out real fast. I hear the attending consul is a particularly punctual sort of character. Please, not another stickler for the rules. Can't be long now. Yep. Got about five minutes to go. Whoa! Well, well, Consul dear. Your reputation certainly precedes you. <coughs> oh, why is it so insufferably dusty around here? Clearly, the place befits its dirt rank status. The rainy season will soon be upon us. I ask your patience for just this short while. Is that so? Then, leaving aside the issue of cleanliness, just what is with all this fog? I don't take kindly to my vision being obfuscated. Go oh, forget it. So, where are my quarters? Yes, this way. What a filthy room. How the dirt rack has fallen. <sighs> I suppose that would be something to take up with the castle. Arthuronis is an old model. I understand your displeasure. But please don't escalate this. Do I detect some defiance? No, no, that, that was never my... Relax, girl, I jest. Now then, let's cut the chit-chat and talk business. 
I'd like you to eradicate some vermin for me. Vermin? By your leave, sir, we've detected no movement from Agni and Pharonesis around this area. Not Agnes. People. Soldiers. A band of deserters from both sides. Well, something like that. Agnes and Kevis. Both. <laughs> I think it's best you see for yourself. Hmm. This is expressly at the Queen's behest. Don't foul this up. Well, Ethel's gonna know who those people are. <clears throat> Queen's behest. Queen's behest. Yours seems to be the only one not locked. Huh? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> He's lit up like a sparking light bulb. I guess there must still be more to this feature. We could change claws? We could change weapons? What in the blazes? I've never used this kind of blade before, but all the techniques I can use with it are flashing before my eyes. <laughs> yes! Always ingrained deep no, within us. It doesn't look like I can get Mimi's gear. Now that's a shame. Mm. This oh, is they are very connected. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. How come I got moody guts and not Noah's, huh? It's so cute! That's what I I'd love like to this. know. Your class is the only one I can seem to pick, unfortunately. Oh, pff, unfortunately. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> Whoa. You can lug this thing about without a power frame. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> then I oh my god, it's even working. But cool. I want to take this new blade out for a spin. Yeah, me too. This is so cool. This is so cool. What the fuck? I always want the girls to have the big anime swords, and they never let us do that. Finally! Yes! Oh my god, look at their little their little chibi artwork. This is so cute. Are you kidding me? This is so cute. Look at how cute that jacket looks with Uni's wings. That's also really cute. What the fuck? I'm obsessed. Oh my god. That white jacket. I want that white jacket. I'm so excited for her to have this big ass sword. This is so cool. Mio has the Monado. Look at Noah in the jacket. Yes. I'll hit him, and then I'm gonna hit him again. <laughs> what? I think that is so cool. I mean, it's fun from a gameplay perspective, but it's also a really, really, really fun and interesting way to really, really show you through game mechanics and battle mechanics that this group is like working together as a team. I love when mechanics are implemented like this into the story and like into the group. This is so cool. The character design in this game, Senna, Senna, Senna. Senna's hyped about the new fashion, hyped. Senna. I love this jacket! It's so fucking cute! What the fuck? Push on and on and on. This frog's armpit is pretty sweaty, but I think we need Rhine here for science and research. It just so happens that Rhine time is 24 hours a day, constantly. It never ends. I don't want to be dramatic or speak too soon, but this has the possibility of becoming my favorite game. I just need to see what it looks like just for my own curiosity. Yeah, it's upsetting. That's yeah. Every single song in this game is perfect. Faster is better. No. We don't want to be dragging no. our heels forever, right? 200 hour playthrough. Hey. Why is this no pawn face down on the ground? Pain, pain. <laughs> oh no. Is this is a big map. I wonder if it's where all the titans like Not to worry. collapsed. Not together at the end. Like I said a few minutes ago, like, you know, all the titans kind of like collapsed together. I'm like so curious about this setting. Oh, this is the hand. Is this the hand? 
like the hand of like where Hidden Village was. That hand? This game is wild. I gotta get on top of this. If this is the hand, I need to see more. I need to get on these fingers. This is some wild shit. So maybe Van Damme can just fucking time travel. Keep it together now, Mimi. I'll drag you along myself if I have to. I mean, I get that it's hot, but really? Whether we're talking food or weather, Mio does not take to heat. I knew this would happen. Heat's never bothered you, has it, Lance? Nope. I'm made of sterner stuff. Well, Lance isn't a human, I don't think. Honestly, or a Homs. I'm starting to feel a little worn out. Lance is... to rest would be nice about now. Hey, Lance look! Is Lance. There! Mimi, look! It's water! There's an oasis! Water? Yeah, water! Water! Her ears! Come on, let's go! That's so cute! Yeah! That's gonna be, uh... An illusion, right? Oh, come on. Talk about overreacting. We should be thankful they're back in high spirits. Let's just hope it's not a mirage. Yeah, mirage. The source of all life! And <laughs> <laughs> the nope on. <laughs> nice and cool. Thank the clock. Then my turn. Oh my you god. Too. Cannonball. That happen every day. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> Are the nope on okay? You mop it. Pop it. <laughs> Never do that again. Come on. You're already soaking wet anyway. What difference no does pun. it make? The difference is, you're an asshole. What snuffing difference? Oh, I've got war in my ears now. Staying here, are you? I've got something to take care of. I'll send it to you now. A map. From the survey branch. Annihilation events occur frequently here. Annihilation events? You mean... This. We saw this at the beginning. Look. It happens here too. Given our route, we should take the safest way possible. Very cautious of you. It's my duty to be. Thank you. Uh, sure. <gasps> nice. I worked up a chunk and appetite with all that moving around. <laughs> Lands on the hunt for something a bit meatier. This is turning into quite the leisurely pleasure cruise, isn't it? You need to relax. 200 hour playthrough, Tyon. Tyon honestly seems just really anxious. Tyon has a lot of anxiety. I just feel like this is just anxiety. Char this is just anxiety character. Poor guy. Where did you get to? I don't know. It looked like they drowned in the lake after Lance jumped in. Manana is a total diva when it comes to cuisine. I can confirm. <laughs> but planned cuisine takes two take two hours to make. In meanwhile, pleasure endure hunger with patience, like well behaved soldiers. What the spark? Two hours. Nothing's worth that kind of wait. Yes, it is. Lance, relax. Friends think food is nothing more than fuel for furless meat sacks. <laughs> P 
this? Nope on. That's a tongue twister. Look at all that alliteration. Friends think food is nothing more than fuel for furless meat sacks. Not simply chuck stuff in pot, then deliver unceremoniously into mouth hole. <laughs> Un <-cere> <laughs> oh my god, Noah is a sweetheart. Then maybe it would get our mouth hole. <laughs> Okay, Noah, I fucking love this game. <laughs> Did I say 200 hour playthrough? Let's meet, how about 300? Oh, it's so cute. It has palpu fruit in it. Manana is so proud. This is precious. <laughs> Riku. Riku. What did Riku say? We are the attendants. <laughs> okay, Riku. Tell me more. At this very moment. Riku cannot. <laughs> Mate, you can't just pull the rug out from under our feet like that. <laughs> oh, Riku, you are precious. Oh my god, it's so cute and tiny. Oh my god, it's perfect size for Nopon. I love how they handled the food interaction so much in this. Everyone is so supportive and encouraging. I really like it. Usually I definitely have favorites. But in this game, I so far, so far, I love all of them. What if I could give them all the same outfit? That would be funny. There's six of you. What is point of numbers if all fight separate and not together? <laughs> Good point, Riku. Good point. Chain attacks. Chain attacks? <gasps> Xenoblade! We are Xenoblading. Yes. I fucking love this game. Chain orders. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. This is wild. They, like, took one and two and just went, like, times 69,000%. <laughs> Riku rated three out of five stars. Lacking. <laughs> Riku is not impressed. We're unstoppable with you around, Senna. <laughs> I'm the girl with the gall. I love this fucking game. Oh my god. They're so supportive. Yeah, I guess. All right, let's roll out. Autobots, roll out. Mia, are you dealing better with the heat? Oh. I'm doing fine today, thanks. I thought quite better than yesterday anyway. Look, they care about each other. They're thoughtful and compassionate. I love this group. I want to explore. So main quest, see ya. Don't die. Oh my God, are you okay? Did I just break your ankles? That was such a sad moan of pain. You sweet baby angel. I did not mean to hurt you. <laughs> oh, look at the wolf. Stuck as always. Fuck. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Uh, uh, I'm so sorry. Oh, hi, fucking Tracy. It? Bitch, Tracy, leave me alone. I I don't want to come to Thanksgiving dinner. Oh yeah, baby, it's rhyme time. I have to cut myself off because otherwise you know how it'll go. I'll stream for 12 days straight. Yeah. Hi, Raiders. Hello. Hi, Harry. Hi, everyone. Hi, Noah. Hi, Noah. <laughs> we are playing your video game right now. We are playing Xenoblade 3. Thank you for the raid, Harry. I really appreciate that. Welcome. For anyone that doesn't know, um, we were just raided by uh, Noah's voice actor, which is very cool. I just want to say thanks again, Harry, for the raid. Thank you again for bringing your community over, and I hope you have a great evening, Harry. Important. <laughs> Instead of sleeping, I was thinking about Xenoblade. I'm gonna get some stuff like out of my brain and into the universe. Okay, so I was thinking about Van Damme and Van Damme's presence in this video game last night. I remember him being in charge of like an orphanage or at least maybe not a full on orphanage, but I remember him definitely like taking on this role of like a guardian for children who had been, um, kind of um, displaced because of the war or had lost families because of the war, almost chooses this group to g give them this Ouroboros thing. I don't know. This is, there's a lot 
there's a, still a lot of mysteries here. Anyway, Vandom shows up and again is kind of has this um, tie-in to like wanting to help kids and, and help give them a, possibly a better life. They use the name Guernica. I can't remember if it was his first name or his last name, but it was like Guernica Van Damme or Van Damme Guernica. I don't know if anyone is familiar with the artist Pablo Picasso, but uh, one of Picasso's most famous works of art is called um, Guernica and it's in a museum in Spain. And it's a huge painting. It is enormous. It takes up an entire wall in the gallery. The painting Guernica is about, it's, it's an anti-war painting. Picasso was making a huge statement um, against the war because of people who were suffering because of, of war. So Guernica is this beautiful protest painting. And if you don't know what it looks like, you should Google Pablo Picasso Guernica. It's it's in Pablo's incredible, it's very like, um, his very unique style. And it's in black, it's all black and white and gray. There's no color in the painting. I was just thinking about how Van Damme is this figure who, who in the, in, the world of Xenoblade, Van Damme has kind of been there and definitely been alongside the war, but has always been trying to pull like survivors and victims of war out and kind of protect them. You do not give a character the name Guernica by mistake. That is incredibly significant. It's just like giving a character the name Noah. I'm sitting over here thinking like, holy fucking shit, is Noah gonna like wake up a Titan and the Titan is gonna be the Ark that they're gonna like take somewhere else. It all just comes back to like the name of a character being so significant and having so much symbolism and meaning behind it. And Guernica has a very, very significant history as this anti-war um, masterpiece. And so I'm thinking about Van Damme being this character that represents um, anti-war, essentially. Maybe he's just one person and he can't stop the war himself, but by God, he is going to give the children the tools to hopefully make their lives better at any cost. And he does, I mean, he, we've seen him die in Xenoblade 2 and Xenoblade 3 so far, so. Although I don't like using the term die because I've seen him in two different games now. Die is obviously a loose term. So I was not sleeping last night because I was thinking about Guernica. I was thinking about Pablo Picasso's Guernica painting and, and Van Damme and Guernica, and they use that name in Xenoblade 3. So. I'm fine. This is normal. This is just how I process video games. This is how I... I'm really feeling it. I'm really feeling it. Who needs sleep when you can think about video games? One of my favorite things to do is see, like, real world art artistic references implemented in video games. That's one of my favorite things because video games are... A, a, a work of art in themselves. So I love seeing like fine art painting and sculpture and photography like tied to um, tied to video games. I love this. Okay, also this music, this game, this music. Okay, <gasps> goodbye. Zeno Yeet, there they go. <gasps> I survived. <gasps> Shit, I... Ow. I made a ladder and I... Then I leapt off the cliff. It's special, isn't it? Your blade, I mean. Um... Sometimes one part of it glows. Why is that? Oh. You can tell. That's amazing. It's hard not to. Oh, right. Is it a secret? No. I can tell you. Oh my god. 
at all the weapons. These poor kids. I like this character. I want to see more of this character. Noah, my man! Are you still playing around with that little toy? Have you considered a knock-on weapon? You might actually get somewhere with that. Oi! You deaf or what, Noah? Garvel? Noah, this is bad. <laughs> Not even a peep. Don't need to pay us any attention. Oh, please. I wasn't ignoring you. Once I finish this set, we can chat! <sighs> well, what were you saying? Noah! For dead weight, you're a right snuffing peacock! You... you slippery little mudder! Well, anything else? You snuffing weakling! <laughs> Blast it all! <sighs> oh, you get it now! Lance! Break it up now. Didn't know you'd be so petty, Garvel. <laughs> Ain't got no time for this muscle head. Wanna say that again? Hmph. <laughs> we'll settle this properly in tomorrow's trial. Move it! <laughs> Noah, are you okay? Oh. Don't let it get to you. That has like guys uh, like that are the first ones to snuff it in a real battle. I have like no, Ender's Game I'm not vibes. About him. Sometimes I really can't call my weapon though. I know this is different, but I worry I'll end up being a burden. Oh no. Never thought that here. Not even once. Thanks. Kind of you to say. It's just the truth. Where are you going? To visit Riku, since it broke. The trial, it's tomorrow. I'm gonna need a new weapon for that. Oh my god, did Riku make the sword? <gasps> What's this? With the circle? Magic sword, Lucky Seven. Lucky Seven? In distant past were seven legendary swordsmith ponds. Over course of seven years, forged sword from seven types of steel. 
No other sword like it in existing. Magic? Lucky seven? Let's. Please forgive good cleave with blade and split clean in halves. Sure about that. Better not pull some you break it, you bought it sneaky sort of deal. Riku would never dream. Just put all of heft into mighty swing. Weird ask. Uh, sure. You want me to cut it? I'll cut it, I guess. Here it comes! Queen's Riku's beans. face. There's not even a nick in it. Friends surprised? Indeed, it's most prized of swords. Even armor of Peronis gets sliced to itsy bits. I think... I'll pass. Pass? So you not have need for? Yeah, it's too strong. Hmm... Noah when Lance and friends to kick buckets? No, what the spark? Same as letting friends die. No, it's not. If friends not fight, cannot survive. Sure, but I don't need to use your sword. Then, why Noah not call Blade? It's not our choice, I just can't. False. Riku see through like transparent. <sighs> Noah can call Blade. Just no big desire of fighting spirit. Riku? Hey, is he serious? <sighs> Noah? What the? All this time? Huh? If death is not option, should live. Only way is fight like life depends. Thinking of self alone is way of coward. Though, Riku no feeling well. I'm afraid. Of fighting, you mean? Of this world. It's so brutal and relentless. And I'm afraid of what we might become. Mate. Oh, ho, ho! Riku knew Noah was hero material. Huh? It true this sword possess incredible power. Might even rob enemies of many much lives, yes. But only those who understand nature of terror have right to wield. Eh, quoth Master Pon of Riku, anyhaps. <sighs> so, if Noah can call Blade now, can still keep Lucky Seven. Maybe in some kind of disguise. In different words, can turn it into sheath. Sheath? Can use it in fights like normal. But if ever push come to shove, time will come when Noah truly need Lucky Seven's strength. Then is only matter of drawing. When I truly need its strength. Exact. If Noah never lose sight of that feeling, one day, such time surely come. That is, if I can master it. If felt a master, just give back. Can pick out different one. Ah, uh, right. Please not to feel specially indebted to Riku. Just take. No need for overthinkings. <laughs> okay. I accept your offer. Oh, and Riku? What is? Mind if I change the name? Me? Lucky Seven just isn't doing it for me. Oh, oh the music in that scene. Noah has a lot of... Empathy, eh? That was a very good scene. I like that a lot. What name did you end up picking? Huh? Um, name. Uh-huh. You don't want to say? Or what? Is it that embarrassing? N no, it's not embarrassing. That's not it. <laughs> I'm getting strong emotional vibes here. I wouldn't say emotional. Nothing wrong with being emotional. I'd say rather something I miss. Yeah. <sighs> you know, you're the second one that's noticed this weapon. Really? Is that something special? It is. And the first? Who was it? She's incredible. And we owe her our lives. 
Ethel? My guess is Ethel. Interesting, a child soldier protagonist who does not want to fight. Cut to Ethel. I love the sound design, you know, whether it's the absence of sound or not. This will be sketchy. Yeah, agreed. What friends are afraid of, hmm? I'm seeing signs of patrols. Was it Colony 4? Colony 4? Colony of Bad But Elites, led by Commander of Great Repute. Whole rest of Kevis acknowledge their superiority. Are you certain? This is Neil Valley. Right. Like Riku said. But how can this be? How can their zone of control extend this far out? Huh? Anyone uh, feel that? Sandworms. <gasps> A quake? Hmm. No, it's... Over there! Mechon, giant Mechon. Giant Mechon tank. Oh my god. That is an enormous machine. Scale is always so incredible. Oh my god. I mean, I know everyone's after us, but like, holy shit, we are children! God, with the hey, red you. eyes, it is you so... The one red eye, one blue eye is so... You know what? I'm just trying not to talk about Kingdom Hearts. It's just different because this, this is like... A f it's like... Not natural. It's I like a... Um, no, look. It's the iris when their eyes change. That's... Ethel! You said Ethel. You mean Silver Code Ethel. You know about her. Even in Agnes, the name has spread far and wide. Silver Code Ethel. Even with the silver hair, she looks like fucking Yozora right now. <laughs> People would whisper <laughs> like, about how she fell three colonies at once with just a hundred troops. Yeah, but this is Ethel. We know her name, so? So, she helped us out once before. She was strong but kind. She could still help. Noah? It might not work, but... Noah! It's all right. Look at that is what she sees? It's me! Oh my god. Noah from Colony 9! It's you know rage what? form! You saved us back in Colony 14! You praised my blade! You must remember! You say I helped you! In Colony 14! You did? Really? She's been put there. They got her with the eyeball. The 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 red no of armored figure yeah. that came to her camp. They <laughs> They're got, they got her. This is far from all right. <gasps> it's pointless. Sorry. I thought I could convince her. Oh, Noah. She it wouldn't work. I mean, good try, Noah. It'll work someday. So Ethel has been compromised. So we gotta Take get... Cover. Bad move. Hands so love behind her back. Just like Morag. Now, the enemy is before you. Chase them to the ends of the world. Not a single one of them. We have escape. to sever this connection here between the armored figure and Ethel. We gotta break this up. I need Ethel in my party. Oh, that's cute. That's a cute animation. I 
I just love seeing everyone hanging out together. Well, they followed us. How do you not hear that approaching? It's literally the storm that is approaching. How does it surprise you? Ethel! So unfortunate. Huh. She read us like a book. Ethel! Do you really not recognize us at all? Disgusting. Huh? The sight of you things speaking the words of man. It makes my skin crawl. Huh? We'll never get through. Come off it. Just what the spark does she see us as? Goggles? She's right there. Why don't you ask her? Might we'll get a straight answer. Okay, music. We're fighting Yozora! Ah! You even have the same type of weapon as Morag. Come on. Join my party. Join my party. Join my party. Join my party. I'll use my thinking muscles for this one. I'll use my thinking muscles! Lance, I love you. Oh shit! Oh my god. She's way too good. Well, I guess we don't call her silver coat Ethel for nothing, eh? Tight pinch keeps getting tighter! <gasps> Mimi? Understood. Ready? We can't. But why not? <gasps> oh, it's do the thing! Powerful. We could just wind up killing her. Oh. Yes, but... <sighs> we can help her! <laughs> we can what fix happened? her. She just stopped. <laughs> what? What? Yes. What am I yes. Fighting against here. Maybe evil now. forces. Ethel, it's me. It's Noah. Did you say Noah? Ethel. <laughs> Oh, it needs must. <gasps> whoa, 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 what? Can't stop. Really? This is why I can't stand far. And we were just getting to the good part. Oh, that's awful. You are pathetic. Ah! Ethel! Huh. I suppose it's more fun this way. I will destroy you. Well, don't you agree? It's the big bad boss. Boom! Here I come! Oh shit, what? I am not prepared for this music! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Alright, console K, I'm gonna destroy you to the best music I've ever heard in my life! <laughs> This game is epic as fuck. Did we do it? Wait. Something's wrong. The light's being drawn in. Same as when Noah and Mimi. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a second. He looks exactly like that other one. Fuck. That Iris. So he was the one controlling the troops. Mobius. So. But he's looking pretty hurt. Come on! Hi, Raiders! Hi! This is 
Spoiler! Oh my god, fuck. I'm in the middle of a boss fight. Hi. You're all great. Hi. <laughs> I have alerts turned off. Welcome to Xenoblade 3. This is the greatest video game I've ever played in my entire life. Hello. Hi. Hello. Any good? Hi. Hi, Lee. Make sure you're lurking. <laughs> he did it again. No Hi, everyone. Way. He's stealing from the clocks. This is really intense. I just heard one of the best, like, boss fight songs I have ever heard in my life. I'm not stealing from them. I, as Mobius, have the right to do with the flame clocks as I please. What? You may hurt me as much as your heart's desire. But where there is life and vitality... I'm afraid I shall not fall. Come now. Why oh, don't fuck you off. give it your best shot? And come at me! <laughs> if you think you can. Stop attacking! Uni! Lance! You must be fucking joking! If we allow it now, he'll take us down! But... Our friends from Colony 4! Wake up, Noah! They're not your friends anymore! They're his fuel! Hi, Lee! <laughs> Even so! <laughs> These soldiers will nourish me! This is like sinister! <gasps> don't bring- if don't bring glitter radishes into anymore. this! You fuck! If I need a little extra, I can I want. He's killing more of our friends. The more we hit him, there has got to be a way. What if we? But then, what? Did you think of something? Huh? Come on. The flame clock. What if we smashed it? You what? How should I know something like... Do you mean... But... What if we just end up killing everybody? Where are you going? If we keep fighting like this, we're all dead. Rock in a hard place, huh? Whatever life is lost, I won't let you soldier it all alone. Mia. Yo, no, we are in chapter two. Get over yourself. Final act? Sure, 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 sure. All right. We'll try it. Lance! What's up? Draw his attention for me. And then what? I'll get in close and destroy the flame clock. What? If you do that... We've got to. It's the only way. On my head be it! The spark you on about! I'm not gonna let you take the fall alone! No, snuff it! Fine! Have it your way! Get going! Uni! Cover fire! Leave it to me! Oh my god. Zion! Zeta! We need you too! Huh? <laughs> Understood. Okay. Just okay. say when, guys. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Thanks, I'm not everyone. ready. I'll count down from three. Three, two, one. Let's go. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. However, if I keep on firing pop shots. I'm bound to hit one of you sooner or later, preferably sooner! Oh no! Crap! Oh. No! Mimi! Oh my god, fuck yes! Yes! Are you sure? Yes! <gasps> oh my god! There's no need for this. 
sorry. I'm sorry about the trauma. I'm really sorry about the trauma. I'm not excited about that. I'm excited about the other stuff. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my. <laughs> Look at the shield. Lance. That form. You mean? Hey, I'm, I'm here, here too. too. Yes. I'm here as well. So then. <laughs> oh my god. Let's go. Yes, you can! I believe in you! Everyone! To where this was taken. I think Yorin did the right we thing. We can go through here, and then we're out. You must flee for the colony. Ah! Dim away! Oh fuck! Oh, these poor kids have so much trauma. My words. They're already gone. Oh my god. Hello? Who are- what? Did, did I? I? <gasps> I did this. Whoa. There's, There's time, time for that later. later. Ah, right. Noah, Leo, now it's our chance. Yeah. What the fuck? I don't even know what to say. Get to your damn thing! Ah, where are they? Where? Where have Get they wrecked! Come? I can't free! Hey, Maya. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Little... When did you get this jump on me? Oh my god! In that case... Now you fight over your eyes! Bad frog is I can't heal! Now is that nothing, Shadow? Go now! Do it! Mio! Yeah! Huh? What? Did, Did that not right? do it? How is it so strong? And we'll try. Teamwork! No Bloody embers. Ah! <laughs> oh, the futility! The flame clock is life itself. Ah, life itself. A coalescence of the will to live. I very much doubt it's going to break that easily now, is it? Sparks. We must have it too. Ha! <laughs> fool's parent indeed. But you know I appreciate what you've done. For bringing your lovely selves so close up. Because now I can look upon you with all your radiance. Ha 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 ha! This guy talks too much. <sighs> But they all do. Oh no! Oh my god, please! Noah and friends will set things right. Give the no pawn one two. The armor of Veronis gets sliced to itsy bits. If it can really take Veronis clean out, then maybe. Mio! Try again! Cancel the interlink after we jump! What's the plan? Looks like the time has come! What are you talking about? Fine, Fine. Ready, Ready when, when you are. are. No! What are you... You're, you're in the link, but why? Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, 
<laughs> oh my god. Uh, power of the Nopon. Riku made that sword. How's that look? Everyone okay? She's gonna be fine. Seems she only lost consciousness. Right. That's good. Oh, what we're back needs? on the ground. Someone who deserves a real thrashing. Playing with our lives like they're nothing. You're dead meat. Mobius. Okay, hi. Hi, 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 hi. Let's fucking go, Yumi! Incredible. I cannot believe what is happening to me in this video game. <laughs> Senna, yes. It's more than I could have ever hoped for from this video game. <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! I cannot believe this is chapter two. I'm shocked. I honestly am not paying attention to anything. I'm just so hyped and overwhelmed and shocked. I'm, oh God, my party's dying. I'm so sorry, everyone. I was literally going in with zero expectations with this game and I am blown away. Play around. No! I don't want to die! All right, K is gone. Good job, Noah. Just playing around, was he? Let's take a look at this ugly mother's face. Yeah. Stuck tight. How'd you get this thing off? Ah. <gasps> this guy. He's so different from us. Is this what consoles look like? All wrinkled. Just like Guernica. Is this what aging's like? I don't know. So it's an old man who's bored and wants to play around and is messing with kids? Oh, fuck no. Stick evil adults? No, 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 no. You're all gonna die. I will destroy oh, all of you. It's you. Adults messing with children? I see. I'm so sorry. All I remember is that I was fighting against some abhorrent creatures. And you tell me it was you. So this is the console. This is how he really looks. He's fading. Just like during a homecoming. Nope. No way. You're not sending him on. You realize how messed up that is? Huh? You think so? How do you not... Think about the things this guy did! He tried to kill us all, and rob the soldiers of their remaining life. You're right. Both of you are right. And Mio? Honestly? I'm not sure I would. Okay. Oh, I'll just do it anyway. Just now, I felt his essence brush past me. It felt just the same as ours. So, I feel I have to do this, you know? <sighs> Mew, have you ever touched a mote of light from a Kavesi? <sighs> They're the same as ours. On the other side, 
The people live hoping the same things as us. Uh, they have a lot of compassion. Oh, look at Uni in the cutscene. <laughs> well, he's started now. Sometimes he's just too kind. That or he just loves his job. He too by the book. An airhead. That's what he is. Don't think he's thinking about it too deeply. Just doing it because it's part of his nature, eh? Hmm. Weirdo. I concur. Mimi. Wow. Sorry. You didn't have to help. It's fine. It's our duty. I'm worried I didn't play well. But why? You did it expertly, just like last time. I still can't stop shaking. Oh, Noah. Because of the flame clock. Yeah. I was terrified. Still, all thanks to your decision, we're alive. You're really... something. It was... a team effort. Just temporarily. We'll put her back. Commander! You're Agnes! Lower your weapons, Boliaris. Come again? I'll explain everything to you later. Please, Boliaris. Uh, sure. Then it seems the flame clock is indeed gone, as you say. And yet, I'm seeing nothing of these symbols you speak of. It seems evident you possess something that we do not have. I see. Sorry for getting you involved. No need to apologize. Exceptional as this is, I consider it a blessing to be freed from constant battle. Glad to hear you say that. I was pretty worried. Are you sure it's okay for us to be hanging around here? My troops are under strict orders. It's true you three are affiliated with Agnes. But we also owe you our lives. We should count our blessings, no? This feels awkward. We can stick it out. Sorry. This is kind of our fault. Don't worry about it. You heard Ethel, right? Hmm. Check out this sick new skill! You're not wanted here. Get on with your business and skedaddle. Capiche? You know what? Fuck you. Don't talk to me or my six children ever again. Well, eight children, because the nope on also. Although, who knows? They're probably 40, just like Riki. The whole rest of the alphabet is going to be like, they killed K. We need to do shit. You know what I mean? Like, we're not safe. What's happening here? Are you yelling at this nope on? This nope on's chilling. That's so cool. That's so cool he's playing the game. That was so nice of him to raid us earlier. That was really special. This music is beautiful. I kind of want to cry. Oh! Noah? Huh? Fuck! 
fuck this music. I cannot. Oh god, I think I might die if I yeet off of here. Shit, 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 but I'm stuck now. Oh no, Noah. Oh! Almost become Bam Bam Schnitzel. <laughs> Actually, you know what I've noticed is the Nopon are less murder hungry in this version, or I mean in this game. In Xenoblade 1, the Nopon are, they want to kill everything. The, every single Nopon side quest is like, please go kill 69 monsters for me and get revenge on my neighbor who's bad at singing and hurts my ear holes. You know what I mean? <laughs> One thing I love about this game is um, characters with different skin tones. I think that's amazing. And different body sizes, different skin tones, different body types. I really love that about this game. It's so important to include those things. The console we fought back there. Uh-huh. Oddly. He was strikingly similar to our own console. Both sides are gonna have consoles. Why is that odd? More accurately, not just similar. They're the same. They're the same? Are they really? Our colonies regard each other as enemies. But if the consoles giving the orders are the same, it means... It means? Hmm. Come on. Just spit it out, man. A console's such a big deal. I thought they were everywhere, like your run-of-the-mill Nopon. Riku refused to let Remark of Uni slide. Got that right? Nopon are rare species world cannot live without. Protect at all cost. Uh, leaving Nopon out of this... What's this mean? That these guys are mega suspicious? Yes. I suspect they may be more deeply involved than we thought. Involved how, though? With what? The theater. With the reason why we fight. With deciding our fate. Our fate. And the queens? You think they're in cahoots? What can you tell us about your queen? I think we've only laid eyes on her once. Right? Yeah. At the homecoming, I think. She had long silver hair. Yep. Real dignified. Proper pretty wings, too. Wings? Like yours, Uni. Sort of. But they were much more of a shining white. Well, as for our queen, she was really elegant. Refined and graceful. And her ears, they were super long. Up to here! Hmm. Guess that means our queens are different folks, all right? The consuls are kind of like the queen's servants, right? The castles. Their role is to convey the queen's directives to the colonies, along with handling admin and decision-making. So what? If we explain the deal to the queen, you think she might actually get the picture? Yeah? Pretty much. I don't recommend getting your hopes up. Oh, yeah? The queens sit at the very pinnacle of the hierarchy. So you think they won't even give us the time of day, huh? I'm saying they might be the same as the consuls, our enemy. What? Also, somehow that consul, he became Mobius. Or maybe... Mobius is the Consuls. The situation's already dire enough. It'll be best to temper our expectations. Is that so? Colony 4. Henceforth, all orders are rescinded. Eliminate Ouroboros at all cost. Make this known throughout the colonies. Ouroboros has no place in this world. Their existence must be erased without a trace. Nia? What?
the fuck timeline? Nia? Existence must be erased? Nia, come on! Will you save the game? Xenoblade 3, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. The queen's ears are taller, like longer. And I was like, well, I've, I've seen Nia's ears. Nia's the only like Gormati I know of with like longer ears. Klaus was up in his little spaceship. Klaus and Galena up in their little spaceship. Klaus is like, Galena's like, Klaus, no, like don't be you know, an evil asshole. Klaus shoves her aside and is like, here we go! And then totally, like, rewrites all of everyone's fates to be... Now Nia is being controlled and our other queen, Melia...